Hello and welcome to another tutorial. In this tutorial, we will learn the four screen type in the IBM I OS. This is one of the four screen types, which is called a menu screen. In this menu screen, you have options to choose from. For example, if I want to go and change my password, I will going to go under the user tasks. So I'm going to choose option number one and press enter. Then I'm going to choose option number eight and I will going to now change my password. To come out of the, any of the screens or the menu, you can simply press F12 to cancel or F3 to exit. Cancel is pretty much like pressing the escape key on the keyboard and F3 is pretty much like closing a window. Now that you are out of the screen, now you want to go back to the previous menu. Again, you can F3 to go back to the previous menu or F12 to go back to the previous menu. Here are the function keys right at the bottom, which you can use with any of the screen on. So if I want to go back to the previous screen, I will going to simply press F3 or F12. Now from here, if I would like to go to a different kind of a screen called the prompt screen. In the prompt screen, there are three columns. So for example, if I want to issue a command to create a library, I'll type the following command. And then since I do not know the exact format of the command, I'm going to press F4, which will going to bring about the prompt. This is where I can fill in the details such as I want to call my library summer 2017. We're going to go over another tutorial which we're going to, where we're going to learn how to create libraries and things like that. But this kind of a screen is called your prompt screen where you have to fill in the blank. So literally it has three columns. The column of the labels, the column of the values, and the column of the possible values. Again, to cancel, I can press F12. The other kind of a screen that you can go to is your list entry screen. So let's go and look how a list entry screen looks like. This is an example of a list entry screen. In a list entry screen, you have options to choose from so that you can work with that particular item based on that option. Here is the list of the options available to you and you can type any one of these options on any one of these libraries or the items and it will going to exercise those options on it. For example, if I would like to exercise this particular library, I can simply go to that item and under the options column, if I want to display it, I'm going to put the option number five and press enter. This would allow me to get inside that library. Again, pressing F3 will going to help me come out of it. Now I'm back to the main menu. Again, I would like to type CRTLIB to create library. Press F4 to bring the prompt, to bring the prompt screen. And now I am on the prompt screen where I would like to understand a little bit about this option or, or in other words, get help. In IBM environment, there are three different kinds of helps. The step number one help is F1, F1, which brings the very basic help to the point short reference help. If you want more detailed help, then you can press F2 and this gives you the detailed help. There is a third kind of help available to you in this environment, which is called F13, which is the IBM Information Assistant. There's also a web version of this available online, or you can help, you can get to it right here in this environment. Now comes the question, how can I press F13 when I only have 12 function keys? So what you do in this environment is you press and hold the shift key, and then you press one of the function keys, so it runs from F13 through F24. So F1 will be F13 when I press shift F1. Similarly, F12 will be F24 when I do shift F12. So here's my IBM information assistant help. So there are four kinds of screen in this environment. One is a menu screen. The second one is a prompt screen. The third one is a list entry screen. And the fourth one is the help screen. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Catch you in the next one. Have a great day.